Here we are, far uh, fairgrounds, just south of Baton Rouge. We uh, got here with no problem. Sections of I-10, boy, it's pretty rough getting here. Those uh, roads definitely need some improvement. But uh, anyway, in Louisiana. So these are the regular uh, fairgrounds where they have their county fair and more than likely county fair. And it's really <laughs> a lot quieter. I'm going to say that because I'm going to take something back I said about uh, the Cajun RV campground we were at the other night. There are trains that go through there and there were a couple last night we swore we were going to go through the trailer like one or two in the morning and one later. So I haven't heard a train yet. There's only uh, two other people here, so you can see why I didn't have to worry too much about reservations, but they've got a lot of spots here. They've got a lot of spots. And we're on the front row. A, B, C, D, E, F. A lot of, a lot of spots. Those are trash cans, by the way, trash bins. Just come by and tip them over into a wagon, I guess. Looks like showers and restrooms up there, which we don't have to worry about. We do have water and electric. It's $79.80 for two nights. Checks and cash only. Here's the fairgrounds over there. There's someone with a horse out that way, walking them. So, this should be nice. I'm hoping we're almost dead level when we pulled in. Had to chalk up on one spot. Hooked up to water. Matthew gave me a uh, filter that was from someone didn't need it. Brand new. I uh, just hooked it up yesterday and good thing I blew it out first because a lot of charcoal came out of that thing until it was running clear. So I'm gonna try that for a while someone steals it at least it's outside and I got the internal one inside but it's very pleasant right now it's about 78 77 in the uh, camper real nice and we came south of I-10 to get here and right through residential area school getting out it was crazy it was crazy but evidently we can just take River Road which is just um, right out here the way we came and we can take that right on into town downtown so I may escape that way too rather than go down that narrow street residential area to get home so anyway water and electric about 80 bucks a day I booked two nights if we want to stay another day we will and go from there so a beautiful day today. It was windy almost all the way, but it really is gorgeous. So retraction on that uh, Cajun RV park, I can see why it's a little cheaper. If you stay there for a while, you probably get used to the you probably get used to that those trains. But they're very noisy.